Hi, I'm Katie, and this is a tutorial video on the different parts of the SparkFun Inventors Kit using an Arduino Uno. First, we're going to open up the box and pull out the various parts. I'm just going to set them side by side. The parts in the side compartment all are different pieces that you'll be plugging in to your, to your Arduino Uno. The most important part of your kit is the center piece. This is your Arduino Uno. We're going to pull this out and set it here. Underneath, you have your breadboard. Both of these will be placed on the little holder underneath. We will save that for another video. On the side, you have your screwdriver, which will also be used in the other video. Mm. Underneath your SparkFun Inventors Kit is a small compartment that has the SparkFun Inventors Kit guide. To, for more detailed information on the different parts, go to page 12 and 13 of your Inventors Guide for a list. Okay. These are the different parts that come with your Arduino. First, you have your USB cable. This will be used to connect your Arduino to your computer to load various programs onto your Arduino. Next you have the different cables or wires that connect different ports and pins to your breadboard. On the left side of your container you're going to find your resistors, your mini servo, and your integrated circuit. Your resistors come in 330 ohms and 10,000 ohms. This is important when using various examples. You also have various colored LED lights and then various parts inside this package. This one has a motor, a relay, some push buttons, some wires, a buzzer, a potentiometer, a couple sensors, and various other tools we will be using in other videos. This is an LCD display. This can be used to show digital displays when using your example 15. Now we're going to attach the Arduino and the breadboard to the holder. You're going to need the two screws that were placed underneath the black holder and your screwdriver that was placed in front. The placement of the Arduino and breadboard go as follows. The Arduino goes in the smaller section where the breadboard goes in the larger section. The orientation of the Arduino and of the breadboard does not matter. It is recommended that you have the red line with a plus next to it closer to the Arduino and the USB port closer to the SparkFun lettering. This ensures that the ground in your pins are closer to your breadboard with the plus side closer to your Arduino. The back of your breadboard has a peel off sticky side that allows you to very easily set the breadboard directly on the plate. Be careful as to not get it off of the side. The Arduino has two screws that go in any of the holes that are underneath the Arduino. I recommend setting the screws in carefully and then using the magnetic screwdriver to screw them in. Because the kit only comes with two screws, you should place them on opposite sides here and here, or here and here, or here and here, 
just to make sure that the board is stable. The holes are tricky. Some of them aren't punched out as well, so you may need to take the Arduino off and screw the screws in directly to the hole to widen the hole a bit before placing the Arduino down and screwing the screw in with the Arduino.